Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Libra. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for uh, the first week of August, okay? The first week of August. We're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for Libra? The first week of August. You and the other person, these first two cards or whatever comes out is going to be the overall energy. You know, it could be the connection, the resolution, whatever. And then you and the other person or you and the other person, however you take it, okay? First week of August. What do we have for Libra? Overall energy between you and them. The lovers. So the lovers is a contract. Okay, there is some sort of contract here. Maybe it's a soulmate contract. Knight of Pentacles. So the Knight of Pentacles is hard work. It's a contract that requires a lot of hard work. Hmm. Now this is a union of some sort. Now a contract doesn't have to be a love relationship. It, 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 I mean, it, does, it could be. But this is some sort of union. Very practical. Very realistic. Very slow. So this is a this is a soulmate contract of some sort. It's a it's a partnership that is was or is meant to be, okay? And was is a is a real word, okay? We don't sometimes we have many soulmates in a lifetime, okay? Now, let's get some cards for over here. <clears throat> been some sort of abandonment in here um, this is wounded expecting trouble so this person over here is expecting trouble they've been wounded they've been abandoned they've been ghosted this is a new day a breakthrough this is happiness so hoping expecting somebody we got somebody over here that is hoping and, ex, and hoping for a new day hoping for a breakthrough so this person over here is hoping and praying by the looks of things but expecting trouble um they've been treated poorly somebody's been treated poorly they chose to be a victim this person has chose to be a victim. They've chosen to be a victim. But the sun card is a card of growth and it is a card of happiness, a new beginning here. So there's an opportunity for happiness if somebody could let their guard down. So this person has been wounded. There is an opportunity for happiness, but sees themselves as a victim, has a victim mentality. has been through some sort of neglect, has been neglected, and definitely is very guarded. So this person has an opportunity for happiness. But there's been some previous neglect that has wounded them. So let's go over here. Three of Swords. Nine of Swords reversed extremely stressed out poor health we got somebody here that isn't healthy somebody's gut is telling them that this is this isn't good this is heartache this is pain this is very very unhealthy um, giving deep 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 thought there could be some extreme regrets ashamed guilty Heartbroken, so this person has been stabbed. They've, 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 there's some sort of heartache here. Guilty over the heartache. Somebody is feeling guilty over the pain that they have caused. Mm, seven of Swords reverse. Now that is um, two faced, cowardly behavior. We have a coward here, somebody that is two-faced. This is danger. This is this is high risk. This is um, illegal activities. 
feeling guilty. Somebody's doing something illegally. This person is going to be having regrets. So whoever this person is does have regrets for cheating or lying or thieving or stealing or doing something. It feels like somebody could get caught as well. You may be dealing with somebody that gets caught. This person may get caught cheating or they get caught doing something. Okay. There is definitely some lies over here. There's some sort of deception. And this is giving deep thought to everything that has happened. This is extremely ashamed, extremely regretful. So this is extreme. So there's, it is. There's some sort of serious betrayal here that's where somebody is, is feeling completely ashamed. Um, there's heartache. There's heart pain. Now this is escapism. This is this is escaping when nobody is looking. There's some sort of sadness here. So this there's sadness over here. This is could be this is like a soulmate connection, reunion of some sort, perhaps, or coming together with a soulmate. Um, there's there's this is a very practical connection, very practical, a uh, meant to be. Something is meant to be. Now there's an opportunity for happiness if you can now this I feel like this I'm not sure which side is yours. This is betrayed. Hmm. Ah and somebody didn't reciprocate in this union. There's a lack of reciprocation. It was one sided. Somebody didn't give. One person did more work than the other. This person is saying why. And, it, and it's true because we got why here. Why? Oh my God, I can't believe this is happening. Why? 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 There's no, there's no help arriving. There's This is, this is losing hope. Um, despair, depression, poor health. We definitely have somebody here that isn't healthy. You're dealing, and I feel, I don't know if it's you or who, which side is yours, but this person isn't healthy. This is definitely ashamed. Both of these cards are ashamed. They're ashamed over the, the heartache that they caused. So somebody is ashamed and they're getting caught. And there's no blessing coming. There's no, somebody's not being blessed because of the heartache that they caused, which is sad to say this is sad so this is somebody that is definitely very much struggling in their mind because they caused some sort of pain so this person is uh, feeling hopeless depressed unfortunately this is very depressed why is this happening depleted sick there could be some sort of illness here as well there could even be some mental illness here Somebody may have not been treated fairly. Um, you know, this is unfair treatment. It really is. Somebody who hasn't wasn't treated fairly. Um, there's some sort of lies and deceit. And oh my God, I can't believe this. Over here, there's there's some sort of information, difficult information. There's there's worry, needing to protect. This person is needing to protect, feeling like they need to protect. Somebody has their guard up over here because they've been neglected, they've been abandoned, they've been ghosted. This person feels bad about it. Now this person is is feeling the need to protect. The need to set up boundaries. So this person is setting up boundaries and a feeling abandoned. There's some sort of abandonment issues over here. Now the Page of Swords is a message is coming. It's a message that comes in the morning. Just so you know. There's a message that is coming in the morning that it may make you feel... Uh, 
abandoned. It may make you feel alone, okay? Um, this is soul ownership. So something, there's a message that is coming that, uh, let's get another card. You were not prepared for. It comes in a morning. I'm not sure what morning. You're not prepared for it. This is lack of foresight. You are not prepared for this message. There is somebody that is going to be delivering a message. Could be a sibling. Could be anybody. But it's gonna be a it's gonna be a very truthful message. It's gonna enlighten you, okay? So this has to do with enlightenment. Um, there's an opportunity for happiness that you don't see. There is an opportunity that you don't see. After being neglected, you have to let your guard down. I feel like you're in protective mode. You're in protection mode. You're wanting to protect yourself. There's an opportunity for happiness here, Libra, that you don't see. You're not seeing the opportunities being so guarded. You're so guarded. You're so defensive. There's defensive, needing to protect yourself. Because of your previous abandonment. So there is an opportunity for happiness here. I don't know who you were neglected by. You may have been neglected by a Leo or a Libra, another Libra, Gemini or Aquarius or something like that. You could have been neglected by uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You've been neglected by somebody. Which has made you um, there's abandonment issues here. Somebody has abandonment issues, and therefore they're missing an opportunity for happiness. So I feel like Libra, you need to let your guard down. You need to let your guard down and just be happy. Anyway, this person over here, there's a lack of reciprocation. There's one-sidedness. Somebody didn't get what they deserve. There's unfair treatment. There's a contract that is... Um, oh, it looks like it's meant to be. This is a soulmate contract that is meant to be where there's been a one-sidedness. There's been no reciprocation. One person was doing all the work. Somebody didn't get treated the way they were supposed to. This is a fraud. The Six of Pentacles reversed is uh, strong control, a fraud, uh, abuse of power, an abuse of generosity. You know, somebody abused their their generosity. You know what I mean? They were they gave but with strings attached. So that's the that's the energy between the two of you. It was one sided. Somebody gave, but only with expectation of getting in return. It wasn't unconditional. So I feel like there is going to be, I mean, this is a manifestation. This is, this is slowly going in a new direction. Very being practical, being realistic. Building a new security. You may be building up a new partnership with somebody. But not really putting in a lot of energy because of the abandonment and wanting to defend yourself. And, you know, needing to defend yourself. And not really let anybody in. It feels like you're not really letting anybody in. Anyway, this person over here is heartbroken. There's somebody that is that is heartbroken. They're feeling ashamed. Very, very, very much ashamed. They cheated. They lied. Uh, whoever this person is does lie. They do cheat. They're not very spiritual. And they're a juggler. This person goes back and forth a lot. Plays games. This is a player. So this person over here is a player. They go. His juggling is a game. Okay, so we got a, we got a player over here that lies and cheats and deceives and hurts other people, and they're this juggler is is so busy playing games that they can't see that the opportunity is passing them by. There's an opportunity to heal and there's an opportunity for things to get better, but they're so busy playing games that they can't that they can't see. So there, we have a we have a player over on this side. 
that is about to get caught or something. They're about to fall flat on their face. That's what it looks like to me. Somebody's going to fall flat on their face. Ah, the Hierophant. So the Hierophant is a teacher, a guidance, a guider, a guidance counselor, um, a mentor, higher power, somebody in authority that is giving advice. So there is a higher power involved, somebody that is very wise that is trying to get somebody to listen that is going to probably tell somebody to listen because the hand is up and is saying listen 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 is is trying to get somebody to listen and this is listen to your gut as well the nine of swords reversed listen to your gut this person is being poked so we have this player over here that hurt another person that is really being poked maybe by their conscience they're having a very hard time sleeping Ah, we have an end. This is an ending. This is the end of a phase, the end of a cycle. Learning a lesson, a teacher learning a lesson. This person over here is about to learn a lesson. They're about to be taught a lesson. Somebody's about to be taught a lesson, okay? This is taught a lesson. So whoever this person is is about to be taught a lesson about how to treat other people, okay? Um, so be prepared for that and they're not this whoever this person is is probably going to have this has to do with regrets you know they're going to have regrets this person's going to be ashamed there could be some public recognition to this person you know could end up on the news they could you know they're 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 doing something against the law and they end up on the news and they end up in jail or something like that um but they're going to be taught a lesson so whoever this is taught a lesson this person over here is about to be taught a lesson and it's a life lesson about hurting other people um, why 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 is this happening it's happening because somebody needed to learn a lesson about playing games playing with other people's hearts Maybe they get cheated on or they get lied to or they get stolen from or something like that. This person over here, you know, is about to experience a change. This is a change. Two Pentacles is a change. So Libra, I would say that this week, this is like the Six of Pentacles is a loss. It is a loss. It is the Six of Pentacles reverse. It's a loss of, um, it's, it's out of balance. This is, this is, uh, now it's interesting. Did we have another six? Why did I think we had six, six, six? It's time to get your life back on track. Anyhow, um, this could be uh, being let go, being fired, okay, unemployment, uh, there's some element of disgrace here as well. The Six of Pentacles reverse is not giving, being realistic. So anyway, Libra, I feel like this week something is going to be taken away because this is taken away. There's been an abuse of power. Somebody used their connection, you know, the love connection to abuse the power. You know what I mean? Oh, permanent loss. 
Okay, the tower reverse. Jeez, I shouldn't have gotten another card. That is an ex that is extremely painful. This is a permanent loss. This is this is health problems, extreme health problems. This is a fight. This is a painful change that you never saw coming. This is a breakdown. Okay, this is a change in environment. This is this is major upheaval. Okay. Uh, within your foundation. So I feel like this week there's going to be some sort of turbulence that probably um, brings about some sort of conflict for you. But it leads to happiness. This is a necessary evil. The towel, an extreme, extreme in reverse. This is extreme uh, uh, takeaway. Okay, it's a takeaway. So it is what it is. We have multiple soulmates in a lifetime. We do. This is a false sense of security teaching a lesson, a life lesson. And this is life change. So somebody was brought into your life to teach you a life lesson. And now the lesson has been learned. Anyhow. I feel like this week you are probably not prepared. This is not prepared. And I feel like this is your side. I feel like you are not prepared and you may be on the defensive. You may be feel you may feel like you uh you hear I feel like you hear some news that puts you on guard. But this news this is unwelcome news leads to happiness that breaks you free because sun is freedom it breaks you free from a false sense of security that you know you are deeply connected to good luck